Hi, I'm Tammy from A Peach Life, and today I wanted to share with you my little stationary goodie haul from Maumee Bookstore. I'm going to, let's see if it focuses there. It is in, um, it says Atlanta, Georgia, but I think it's kind of like Chambly or Chambly, Georgia. I don't know, I'm not from Georgia. I do sometimes get the names wrong. It's just, uh, it's adorable. They have a lot of Japanese stationery I've shared on here before in my Instagram. So let's get started and take a look. Right out the gate, I'm gonna show you a cute card that the owner had given me. It's a birthday card. It's just adorable. She shared with me the little, what it says. I can't remember, but I remember it was really cute at the end, but very adorable since it was just my birthday. Um, and then I got a lot of, by um, Joystar, a lot of little um, OCAT stickers and stationery and stuff. For me, I have a hard time finding these items. So when I do find them, I definitely like to grab them up or at least not find them, but maybe limited of them. Okay, so these are like the little clear stickers. And I just like to use these in like my little planner, my everyday planner. And another little cafe one. I don't know who that one is by, but it's so cute. And I love the little shop here. And then um, I added some little of the glue sticks. I usually get them from like jet pins, but I love that she had some and I was getting low. Then of course, I had to pick up these because they're strawberries and I love, I love everything with strawberries. Okay, so there's those little guys. And then these are stickers. And they're more of the little OCAT by um, Joystar, right? Yeah, Joystar. And in the background, the music I have playing is um, Japanese Zen Garden. It's like little relaxation music. So I thought that would be a nice one to put in the background. And it's on Apple Music. And these are little cards. I love the little dog there and the cute shop. I got Mousy peeking through. Hi, Mousy. You're really just going to climb right in here, huh, buddy? Huh, my little sweet girl? Okay. Uh, this one is a little bookshop. The bike, so that was a must. And a lot of times I'll um, maybe add a little more decoration or things to it and slide it in the front of my Hobonichi cover. If you have a clear cover in your Hobonichi, I like to... Um, put the cards in there or laminate them and be able to use them in different ways. Another little card. Okay, I thought these were really super cute. I have a couple others. They're like a little trifold stationary little organizer. And I don't think these are um, like post-it style. I think they're just like memos where you can peel. Let's see, mouse, you're really right in here. Yeah, just like memo sheets. Uh, sometimes I'll trim them and toss uh, that half like in my little book, my little pin pouch or my little um, book bag or something like that. Or you could just take the whole thing. Or sometimes I even trim, like trim off one and put it in the little slot of maybe my little, one of my little planner booklet, planner booklet slots. Okay, so here's the other one. And they just have really cute little pictures and things. They're fun to add into your little art journals or planners or add a little oomph and cuteness. And you get lots of them, so it makes it nice. And then these are the little memo pads. And you get four different designs in each one. 
and cats are just my thing like I, I love Disney so I share a lot of Disney but um, and Hello Kitty like Sanrio but like outside of that little world uh, cats and birdies are a must and probably even more so I'm drawn to little cats okay and there's this one Let's open that one real quick just to take a look inside. Look how adorable that looks. And then a lot of times, since I, you know, you get so many of these, I will break up. Is this one a double? This one looks similar. <laughs> um, I'll break up the different little packs and add them in my Etsy shop. That way you can get a little variety and use a lot of the same items that I use in my art journals, in yours or your planners. And then, no, that's different, okay. The little covers are so cute. And sometimes I'll add the little, um, the little Carol K pack um, tea to the little art journal kits as well. Um, today, my Etsy shop is closed, but you can always go on to uh, Etsy to a Peach Life and favorite it. And then when it's back open with new items and goodies, it will notify you. Oh, that's adorable. Look how cute. So they have different little themes. That one's food. I felt like one of these seems similar. And then on the back, it shows... Um, like a little picture of each, which this is also really cute. I, I'll save these to add into my little art journal somehow. I always love to save my little packaging from things. And then let's see, next week I'll be going to New York and hitting some like really cute specialty stationery shops as well. Um, so in all of that stuff, I will be bringing back items. And again, I can't use all of this amount. So a lot of times I will divide things up and add a, and make little, um, like little stationary, a little specialty paper kits and, um, either on their own or again with a little Carol K pack, Buzzy B or something tea. And that way you can have the opportunity to utilize some of the same items or not have to buy so many packs of stuff, but you get such a little variety of goodies. And then did I open this one? And then, um, yeah, it just makes it a lot of fun. And then you can get some teas to create in your tea journal as well. And then I have two more little items here. This one I got, it's the same by um, the Joy Star. Let me open this. I thought this would be really cute when I get new fountain inks. I, I feel the little opening here. New fountain ink colors. And when I ink up a fountain pen, I thought it would be nice to put the little sampling on here. Well, I'm really having a hard time with that. Let's see. Okay. So I thought, um, can put that over there to save. I thought this would be cute. And I could write the name of like the fountain pen it's in, like the fountain pen, the brand and the color and then the type of ink I'm using, and then do a little smudge and testing of that ink color. And let's see. And then I can kind of reflect back, or sometimes I forget what, what is inked with. So this would be just like a cute little something to have it all in. A lot of times I put it in an insert in one of my planners, and that gets moved all about. So this is kind of like a perfect little catch all of them that's just sitting at my desk that I can grab um, real easily and know where that's at. Okay, so uh, if you're interested, be on the lookout for some of these little goodies added to plus all the items 
that I'm going to get from New York next week. I plan on really splurging and having a great time purchasing. And again, a lot of those items I'll also divvy up because I can only use so much. And I really love when sometimes people will have little goodie kits like that. They're kind of my favorite. So I love to be able to offer that as well. If you have any questions at always, as always, comment below. I answer all my comments and I'm also on Instagram and Facebook if you'd like to follow. Thanks so much for joining me and I'll talk to you soon.